Hello, I'm Richard Barnes for Whale Tankers. I'm talking to Willie Heller. You're the CEO of Owl Waste Logistics. Um, you're in partnership with Whale at the moment, developing an exciting new product. Could you tell us something about it? Yeah, so uh, we, together with Whale Tankers, have created a new uh, renewable uh, device that basically will manage food waste. It's called the Bio Whale, and we are deploying that across the entire United Kingdom, doing it quite well. How many units are out there at the moment? We've got five operating units and we have four more units on the shop floor being manufactured back at Solihull. Okay, why did you choose Whale to partner with you on this project? Whale has been making uh, tanks for mobile purposes for the last 40 or so years and so they're the absolute leaders in vacuum tank technology and they had a great interest in also basically getting into more green and renewable activities and so this was a natural. What sort of feedback are you getting from clients where you've uh, actually installed the BioL? The people love it. Uh, it's cleaner, it's greener, there's no odors, it eliminates any issues in terms of pests, rats, seagulls. So no, everybody who has it likes it and everybody that we're in conversations with likes the idea. So no, it's going over very well. So tell me through the idea. You, you place a BioL at a place where there's a lot of food wastage? Yeah, so we will install a bio whale, and there's three sizes of them. Uh, we'll install the right size one for the amount of volume being created. So our smallest bio whale will store up to four tons, the standard one 12 tons, and the large one 24 tons. And depending on how much food waste is being generated, we'll place a unit there. The unit is built into a steel container, so very easy to install. What the client does is they don't do very much different than what they're doing now. They put their waste into a bin. Rather than wheel the bin out to their waste area, they just bring the bin to the bio whale. And if it's a small bin, they can lift it up and tip it into the hopper. If it's a larger bin, 120 or 240 liters, there's a bin lifter built into the bio whale and it just lifts it up and tips it into the unit. The unit pulls it in under vacuum, very much like an airplane toilet. It then macerates the material very finely, generally to an eight mil particle size. The material then goes into a stainless steel vacuum tank where we mix it, hydrolyze it uh, for two to three weeks. And when the, when the unit is full, it lets us know either via an SMS or via Wi-Fi, and we dispatch a vacuum truck to remove the material. That material goes to an anaerobic digestion plant where it's all converted into energy and organic fertilizer. So I suppose using a technology like this must have posed a lot of challenges um, and Whale have come up with innovation. Uh, is, is this the first time that this has been done in this country? This, we are the only uh, manufacturers of anything close to this device in the UK and pretty much there's very little of it even internationally. So we have a unique product, we've got a couple of patents on it and uh, it is purpose designed and built for food waste. So um, going forward then, where, where do you see the bio, bio oil in five years time? Uh, well, in five years time in the UK, I think that we'll basically have a huge network. Uh, we have a capacity to manufacture about 50 units a year in Solihull, so I see us deploying a lot of the units here. We're already getting interest internationally because globally, everybody is basically trying to uh, recycle food waste. It's, it's, it's kind of the latest issue in terms of recycling is food waste going to landfill is just not acceptable anymore. This is a much superior solution to that and as I said, it's a global issue. We Heller, CEO of Our Waste Logistics, partnering with Whale on the BioL. Thank you very much.